500. How y'all doing? Can you see me jamming in the background? Yeah. Well, today, guys, I, this is my first Zer video. I'm gonna tell you what he's selling, what what I think you should buy, maybe, um, if it's got good rolls. So let's get right into it. Today he has oh he's got insurmountable skull for it. All right, so if you're a if you're a melee titan like a lot of people, a lot of people like hitting with titans because their 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 melees are actually pretty strong. So this insurmountable skull for it is actually a discipline and strength build, which is perfect for uh, titans, um, honestly, because uh, titans um, grenades are they're pretty they're pretty powerful grenades. And strength gets you your melee back faster, so you guys definitely should check this check this roll out. Um, gain super, gain bonus super energy from melee kills. Um, hands on the heavy lifting, gain super bonus super energy from heavy weapon kills on on minions of the darkness and invigoration, melee energy and or pickups. It's not the best roll in terms of perks, but you can always glass needle it if you really need to. It's twist fate. And, the, and for the hunter, they have the Actio Fade Symbiote. It's actually a pretty good roll. It's got intellect and discipline rolled. Um, that's what a lot of hunters look for. If not, it's a discipline and strength, so you can get your grenades and melee back faster for you Night Stalker Titans out there, or Night Stalker Hunters. My bad. You have Inverse Shadow, Second Thoughts, and Innervation. So it's actually a pretty good, pretty good little roll. It's not bad. And then you have Heart of Praxic Fire. This one's actually a super intellect build or super discipline build. It can, you, I think your intellect can get all the way up to 101. I think if I remember correctly, that's what it's showing. Yeah, 101. So if you need that massive boost to your discipline, this will be it. This is for the warlocks. Um, I use this a lot in year one. I love this this chest piece. A hand cannon ammo, sniper rifle ammo, which is good if you're a thorn user or a last word user. Then sniper for your 1k stairs if you really need to. Solar armor and burn and void burn defense. This is weird because normally it's solar burn defense or solar uh, solar double down. Is that it or, or it's solar recovery? But this one actually has two different armors, so which is actually pretty good. Um, uh, two different kinds too. But yeah, definitely check this uh, chess piece out, guys. Then you have the exotic Ingram for the helmets. Which is pretty actually pretty sweet too. If you're three or four or higher, you you have a chance of getting three tens. But if you're three eleven and higher, it's guaranteed three tens if I remember correctly. So you can get your uh, light level up pretty fast with some of these. Um, get them for your alt characters. Then you have a legacy um, helmet Engram. I'm actually might buy a few of these because of the main fact that there's some year one helmets for all of my characters that I don't have mainly for my titan I don't have the glass house and I don't have the eternal warrior so I'm definitely gonna try and pick up some of these then the curios plasma drive um, permanently upgrade and equip rare sparrow to improve overall speed and durability void drive void effects cause this experimental drive to produce a purple contrail under boost heavy ammo sense for you people who are trying to get your exotic class items Heavy ammo scents are a really good thing because you only take like 94 or 96 of them to get one rank. So if you have 100 strange coins, that's 300 am um, ammo scents and possibly in a, it's a, that's three ranks right there. So if you have some extra spare strange coins, spare strange coins, you can, you can dump some of those into your factions. Hey, you can get some shaders and ships and emblems while you're at it. Maybe a good god roll weapon. So check those out. Three of coins, of course. If you're if you're trying to uh, finish collecting or um, finishing your exotic armors, even if you're missing an exotic armor, definitely check these out. Glass needles, of course, and of course you can always change two strange coins for one mode of light. Not recommended. But yeah, guys, that's what Zer has this week. Um, remember to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe, guys. Um, check out my brother Cyber Knight channel. He's he, he actually did me a solid and you guys will get to see that video soon um, I did a highlight video a thank you video for what he did on his channel he shouted me out on his YouTube so definitely check him out check my channel out like favorite comment subscribe let me know if you guys want to see me do anything else I actually have a plan to do um, 
the Weapons Day, Arms Day packages that I picked up. I'm going to do a video about those too. And uh, definitely check it out, guys. This is Darkjack500 signing out. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.